In our rapidly evolving world, success is defined by turning challenges into opportunities. With enough foresight and ingenuity, the complex problems of today can become the achievements of tomorrow. I'm Fred Thompson. From business and technology to healthcare and the environment, join me as we take a closer look inside the workings of the modern global economy. Welcome to Inside Business. I'm Fred Thompson, and I'm Inside Business. Tomorrow's leaders and decision makers are students hard at work in classrooms of today. Let's learn what's being done to stimulate the minds of the future. Millican University student Brandon Graves is discovering the art of entrepreneurship at the Blue Connection Art Gallery in downtown Decatur, Illinois. Graves, along with other Tabor School of Business and College of Fine Arts students, is directly involved in the day-to-day -day decision making process of managing the gallery. Most universities would think it's completely ridiculous to let a student run a business, but here at Millican we actually get to do that with the Blue Connection. Not only do you get to learn the classroom theory inside of the classroom, but we actually get to apply it to real life and everyday business situations. This collaboration between the two programs enables business students to gain insight into the creative aspects of entrepreneurship, while art students learn the importance of marketing their own artwork. At the Blue Connection, I've done many jobs from promoting the gallery outside to promoting the gallery via the web, and it's taught me so much. I've learned how to take that classroom knowledge that I'm learning in, from my marketing classes, my management classes, all the different business classes I'm taking, actually apply it to what I'm doing here at the Blue Connection. It really puts me to that ownership role and it holds me responsible. Unlike homework, you have homework, but here, this is actual business. If you don't do your job, the business is gonna fail. At the time when James Milliken founded the university in 1901, his theory practice approach to education was unique. Today, with 2,300 diverse undergraduate, graduate, full-time, and part-time students, the university takes education a step further with an approach known as performance-based learning. Any university today that's preparing students for professional success has to prepare a student for that first job, but also give him or her the skills to transition into new career possibilities over time. So at Millican, we, we focus a lot on that first professional success but also then help students to think about and transition into new possibilities over time. College of Fine Arts Dean Barry Pearson says this performance-based approach is seen in virtually every facet of the institution. At Millican, students are able to connect uh, their majors and the students that they meet and grow very close to in their majors to their learning and living community outside of their, their discipline. So many of our students who are theater majors or art majors or music majors will live together in, the, in very tight-knit groups. That simply allows them to have a very strong support mechanism. Biology major Lisa Lundstrom was recently involved in an important environmental research study. Every weekend for about 11 weeks, we would drive um, up north about three hours to Wynat, Illinois. Uh, where we were doing a wind turbine study. Uh, we were basically looking uh, to see how uh, the wind turbines had been affecting uh, bird movements to see if they were staying away from the towers or if they, were, uh, if they weren't bothered by them at all. Students also engage in performance-based learning beyond internships and outside of the classroom projects and studies. At Millican, students find that their support system is very important. So the students that they meet and grow very close to in their majors are students that they often live with. That gives them a support mechanism and a support community that's really important. Parent Donald Cropper understands the value of the education his son DJ is receiving. I definitely see a difference in the Millican education. The administrators and the faculty here are committed to the student success. Even the president of the university is, is involved with the students on a day-to-day -day basis. Dean Pearson says it's this supportive environment and commitment to students that has helped the university produce such successful graduates. At Millican, our professional success after graduation is 99%. So 99% of our students upon graduation have some type of engagement professionally. Uh, that's a powerful statistic. What makes it happen, though, is our students are well on their way to a professional uh, setting bef well before they graduate. They've practiced the skills and they've practiced the professional uh, mindset that one needs for success after graduation. It's a very powerful combination. 